Hi guys, Karen B. Sweta, how are you? So today we're doing a stability ball abs and lower body workout. You just need a stability ball and a mat and we're gonna get started. So let's go ahead and lie down on our back and we're gonna start with our feet right on top of the ball. Shoulders down and back and I just want you to slowly on the inhale, give me a thumbs up position. We're gonna reach the arms and legs and then on that exhale, draw the navel into the spine and bring those knees back. Again, on the inhale, we're just gonna start to reach and then on that exhale to bring in. Let's go two more, we're gonna change this. Inhale away, and exhale, return. One more here, inhale away, and exhale to return. Now, just the right leg is coming on top of the ball. Left leg goes straight up to the ceiling. Inhale, right leg. Exhale, we're gonna lower the left leg down to the top of the ball. Inhale. Think about your deep abdominals helping to bring that right leg in for four more. And three, show me two more here, two, last one to the finish, and switch, left leg is on the ball, right leg starts to the ceiling, rolling the left leg away, exhale, return, rolling away, good, so from this position, we're going to add that movement here, bringing the leg on top of the ball, inhale, exhale, four more here, for four, and three, how are we doing guys? Two more here, last one to the finish, and one, both feet come back up. Step back on top of the ball, shoulders off the ears, inhale, one. Turning on your deep core first, make sure you squeeze the buttocks, and we're gonna lift up to a bridge for eight, lower down, fire the seat, seven, six more here, six, whoo, five, we got four more here, four to the finish, three, show me two, two, last one, we're feeling those legs come all the way down. How did we do? We're gonna add on to that, take an inhale, one. Draw the belly, squeeze the buttocks, everybody lift your hips up nice and even, rolling out to a hamstring curl, take it in for eight. Back of those legs are burning, seven, six, Five, show me four more here, four to the finish, three, how those hamstrings, two, and one, come down, top of the knees are over the ball, shoulders off the ears, arms overhead, inhale, rising up to flexion, and inhale to come back down, All right, so the hips are nice and relaxed here with the legs over the ball, show me four more here, for four, looking at that navel as you come up, and three, Two more here, stay with me, and two, how are we doing guys? Last one, and come all the way back down. Good, we're gonna bring the palms down, hug the ball a little bit more with the back of those legs. Draw the abdominals in, a little reverse curl, roll it down. A little reverse curl, no weight in the header, neck. Four more here, four, like a rollover prep in Pilates, right? Three, two more here, two, Drawing that belly in, you got one more, show me, show me, and we rest. Take the ball to the hands, legs go straight up to the ceiling. Shoulders off those ears, arms and legs moving away from the midline, inhale. Exhale, rising up so the ball comes to the shins. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, rising up. We got four more, I'm adding on to this. Listen, listen, we're feeling that core, three. Show me two more here, and Two. Now on your last one, we're gonna come up, hold. Open the legs for a little stretch, inner thigh, lower arms and legs together, right? If that's too much, bend the knees and you can reach through with a little bent knee position. All right, we're moving, let's go, let's go. We got four. Woo, we feel that belly, three. How are we doing guys? Two more here, two. Last one, burning and rest. Place the ball to the shins, place the palms to the ball. Right arm, left leg, moving away from the midline. Exhale, switch, left arm, right leg. Bring it in. Right? Notice guys here how you're really working that deep core. We're not coming up to a curl, but you really gotta stabilize to keep your hips and pelvis nice and neutral as your lever here of arm and leg move away. That's hard, especially if you're tight in the hips. You may be like, oh, this is a leg exercise. <laughs> Right, which it could feel like, and I feel it too. But think more core, four more. Three, you have it. Two, show me last one. 
one and rest. Hug that in, bend your knees for me. We're gonna hold the ball, shoulders off the ears. Slowly take it overhead, inhale, nodding the head. Find your imprint as you exhale, lift up to your curl, look at that belly. Inhale, we come down. Exhale, rising up to flexion. Right, the ball is not heavy, but you're feeling that extra little bit of weight, that extra load challenging you. Three more, and it's hard. Three, show me two, two, show me your one. We're gonna stay up on this last one, and I want you to hold. You're gonna make a rainbow with the ball to the right, whoo, to the left, to the right. If I need to modify, knees bent or feet flat to the mat. You got four more, four, three more here, guys, three. Go with it, two more here, two. My obliques are on fire. One more on each side, and we rest. Roll up to seated all the way. Nice job. I want you to come on to your sideline position with one hand down to that mat, okay? We're gonna start with the top hand to the head, and then once you can stabilize here, we're gonna connect, lifting up. If you're close to a wall here, you can put both legs against that wall, and that will help here. The knee down helps from sliding. It's like a little side bending position, lateral flexion. Go slow. You can use your hand here if you feel more stable, but think of the connection of rib and hip coming together here. Four, making that rainbow. Three, two, and one. Now we take the hand down, we take the arm up, shoulders plug. We're gonna lift up and down, seven, there it is, six, five, show me four, four, three, two, and one. From this position, bend that leg, pulse it back, squeeze that glute, six, five, like you're poking that wall behind you with that toe, three, two, one, and switch sides, way to work. All right, guys, coming over to the other side. Stabilize with that knee, come against the wall if you need. Hand is down, so you have plenty of options. If you can bring that hand up, you're gonna exhale to lift. There it is. Find that side bend position. Give me eight more here. Eight, seven, six, five, feeling that waistline. Four, three, you got two, two, and one. Way to work, guys. Hold, shoulders off the ear. Lift that leg, eight, abduct, seven, six, five. Show me four more. Four to the finish, outer thigh working. Two more, hold that leg up, bend point, squeeze, back an inch, back an inch. Seven, six, five, four more, three, two, one. How did we do? All right, coming on to the ball here. So what I want you to focus on, belly on the ball, and then we're gonna walk forward. Now, I'm gonna be coming into knee stretches. I might be holding this. This is a little more basic option to start holding plank and get you strong to get into that full move. Come forward if you can. We're gonna roll the ball in on the shins the ball is, and roll it out. The further to the toes, the harder it is. Eight, seven, remember your option of just holding. Six, five, four, three, two. How do we do? Last one, hold and come down. Nice job, back onto the ball, working that booty. Think of frog legs, so your hands are down, Shoulders neutral. Once you find that stable point, bend your knees, squeeze your heels. Let the knees drop, hug the ball. Squeeze in your heels, continuing, and lift with the butt. You got eight, seven, six, show me, show me, five, four, three, last two, Last one, point and stretch, long lever. Lift the legs. You're externally rotated, so we're turning slightly from that hip joint, heels turned in. You got four, you got your three, we got two, and we have our one from this position. 
Come back to that frog leg. Now I'm gonna go down. We're gonna pulse. One, two, three, and lower. Three, two, one. Really make that booty burn. One, two, three. You got three more like this. Lift, lift, lift. Show me two more. Upper body is strong and stable. One more. Three, two, one. Reach the legs long. You have a pulse. One, two, three. Lower, straight leg pulse. Lift, lift, lift. That's hard. Three more. One, two. Don't use momentum. Two more. You gotta squeeze that glute. Squeeze that glute. Core is in. Show me one more. That's hard. Lift with the butt. Lift with the butt. And it's easy to cheat there, isn't it? All right, guys. Thumbs up position. Shoulders neutral. We're gonna roll out and in. Option one, stay. Option two, getting more into the rectus abdominis. As long as you're okay in the low back. Squeeze the butt. Core is in. Saw. Seven. You got six more. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. My friends, we are done with our stability ball, lower body ab and leg workout. Thank you so much for joining me guys for this quick but super efficient workout that you can add to the end of your cardio, the end of your strength, really turning on that core. All right guys, have a blessed day. Be sure to like this video if you did enjoy it and please give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to Workout Hotel so you get my videos posting now every day by 4 a.m. and Wednesday's going live at 8 a.m. for a longer workout, so definitely join me for that. And if you can't catch it live, it's always posted later that day, guys. All right, let me know your feedback, your questions, anything you need from me, guys. Stay working hard. I'm blessed to have all of you keep moving every day. Focus on the positive, no matter what's going around, around you. We know the news to be shut off is sometimes the best decision. Um, playing some music in the background in the morning when the kids wake up, when the family wakes up, as opposed to the news could really brighten that day. So try that out and let me know how that works out for you. I will see you tomorrow for sure for the next workout. Bye guys.